people of the purple butterfly here otherwise known as people of seven on twitter and youtube people of elsewhere on the internet and my blog is located purple butterfly dash people dot blogspot dot com and of course my soaps can be ordered off of people dot etsy dot com i'm about to make my first batch of lye based soap so there will be a curing time of six weeks well four to six weeks and when those are ready, they will be listed on Etsy. I'm thinking possibly listing them ahead of time with a, um, you know, advance or reserve date. Haven't got there yet. In the meantime, about the Cralo, someone asked me about separation. Because you are using um, a little grapeseed oil, some shortening, and a water-based product and mix it together, sometimes it separates and you'll have this little puddle of oil. For me, when that happens, which, I mean, if you look, you can see it's already doing that. There's literally oil floating on top. Because of the kind of container I use it, I just literally shake it up, then continue using it. But if you're the kind of person that wants all your stuff congealed, then all you have to do is get yourself some vegetable glycerin, which, um, can be used as an emulsifier or some xanthium gum. Um, what else can be used? Um, Aguave nectar. Anything you know that will bind a oil to a water to emulsify it into a um, single component. You know, basically like lotion. Lotions are oil and water, but they don't separate. All they did was add glycerin. That's the secret ingredient. 